This is Psalms 55 and 21. The words of his mouth were smoother than butter, but war was in his heart. His words were softer than oil, yet were they drawn swords. Brakata Yahweh, Brakata Yahweh Shai. Brakata Yahweh, Brakata Yahweh Shai. Brakata Yahweh, Brakata Yahweh Shai. Kal Halal Yom La, Allah Yahweh, Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai. Bahashem Raka Kodash. Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and salutation to the hopefully elect. This is the brother Bashar from GMS Bahamas Camp back at you with another lesson. Shalom Akim. Yeah, I watched the lesson. A Salaka movie, The Twelve Year Slave. I'm sure many of you Akim on them had watched that before, you know. And when I watched the video, it was disturbing to me, man. It, it, it really upset me to see the way you saw Edom did us. How they treated us. You know, in that movie, they made a movie order, but we know that everything is up Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. You know, the way he saw treated us. You know, the rapes, the gags in the mouth, the murder. So, like cattle, separation from our family, you know, uh, castration of our genitals. You know, Esau Edom, you will pay. It's going to be a recompense for that. It's going to be a recompense. I can take it from the top again. This is Psalms 55 and 21. The words of his mouth were smoother than butter, but war was in his heart. His words were softer than oil, yet were they drawn swords. We know you all don't, 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 don't like us. We know that. But it's going to be a recompense, a recompense for the, way you, for the way you all treated us. We know that the Most High allowed it to happen for judgment to come upon us for us not keeping the laws and commandments and statutes what he gave to us, his chosen, the children of Israel. But it's going to be a recompense because you took it too far. All right? This is uh, the book of uh, Psalms. Psalms 28 and 3. Draw me not away with the wicked and with the workers of iniquity. Which speak peace to their neighbors, but mischief is in their hearts. And that fit you, Esau, Edom. You know, like this book, like it says in Psalms 51 and 21, the words are smoother than butter, slick. You come talking peace in one, with one hand, and the next hand you got a sword. You know, we know you all don't like us. It's going to be a recompense for what you did to us, though. Believe you me, it's going to be a recompense, Esau, Edom. Prepare yourself, you know, get ready. All right. Uh, I tell you, that movie made me cry, almost made me cry. It, it, it hurt me, man. The first time I watch it, then it spread up on me to watch it again. And I said, I could do a lesson on it, you know. This is uh, Psalms 49 and 11. The inward thought is that their houses shall continue forever and their dwelling places to all generations. They call the lands after their own names. Cain was the first one did that in the book of Genesis. You know, and you're all still doing it to this day. Because you all don't think that this this you all don't think that your rulership is gonna come to an end. But it's gonna come to an end. Like the scripture say, y'all in thought is that your houses shall remain forever, but that ain't happening. That ain't happening. Alright? Uh this why y'all thinking that too. This scripture right here is uh Psalm 17 and 14. For men which are thy hand, O power. Salak. From men, Psalm 17 and 14. From men which are thy hand, O power. Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai. From men of the world which have their portion in this life. And whose belly thou fillest with thy hid treasure. They are, they are full of children and leave the rest of their substance to their babes, and that's what they do, they build up these empires, and pass it on to their children, you Esau eat them, you know, all our, all our stuff, because everything with you all have belongs to us, and, you know, and we will reclaim what is ours, just keep that in your mind, we will reclaim that, you know, uh, 
and 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 this one here, this one here marched me down plenty. This is the book of Luke uh, 12 and 47. And they used this to justify just to whip us in that movie. This is uh, Luke 12 and 47. And that servant which knew his Lord's will and prepared not himself, neither did according to his will, shall be beaten with many stripes. They used this in that movie just to justify to whip us. Split our back open. But like I said, no, everything was judgment. From Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. You know, the most I use you all to bring that judgment on us. But just know it's going to be a recompense of what you all did to us. You know, like I say, the separation from our family, the castration. That you wake us six days a week. On a, on, on a Sunday, you give us Caesar Bajir, that faggot. You know, the hangings. The feeding our baby, the, 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 the alligators. You know, which, like I say, it was judgment from Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. But... It's going to be a recompense of what you all did to us. So just bear these things in mind. Esau, eat them. We're going to get you. We will get you. All right. Uh, I could try not to make this too long. Okay, just hit these precepts and get out of here. Uh, Isaiah, Isaiah 34 and 5. For my sword shall be bathed in heaven. Behold, it shall come down upon Idomia and upon the people of my cursed judgment. The sword of the Lord is filled with blood. It is made fat with the fatness and with the blood of the lambs and goats, with the fat of the kidneys of rams. For the Lord had a sacrifice in Bozrah, and a great slaughter in the land of Idumea. Yeah, you saw Edom. Prepare yourself. You know, this Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai saying this. So we, it's going to be a recompense for the way you'll treat us. Don't think it's going to go undone. All right. This is uh, Jeremiah 49 and 10. But I have made Esau bear, I have uncovered his secret places, and he shall not be able to hide himself. His seed is spoiled, and his brethren, and his neighbors, and he is not. The most high your power, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai said that he has made you bear. That made all your secrets, everything is exposed. You know, you see all the all the all the dirt you did, everything is now coming out, everything is being revealed. You thought you think all the things you did was gonna be hid forever? Then you'll be trying to shut down our YouTube channels and what's not just because we bring out this truth. When it ain't the views you're jacking with is the subscription. When it ain't the subscription. Oh man, you all can't do nothing with us no more. And this truth already out, you know. This is out, Esau Edom. This is out. You know, you are exposed. You are exposed. The most I said he would make you bear. All right. Uh. This is Ezekiel 35 and 5. Because thou hast had a perpetual hatred, and hast shed the blood of the children of Israel by the force of the sword in the time of their calamity, in the time of their iniquity, slack, in the time that their iniquity had no end. Therefore, as I live, said Yahweh Bahashem Yahushai, I will prepare thee unto blood, and blood shall pursue thee. Sit thou hast not hated blood, even blood shall pursue thee. So, an eye for an eye, a life for a life with you, Esau, you will pay. It's going to be a recompense. You had no problem shedding the children of Israel, blood our blood. So, we ain't going to have no problem shedding your blood. You know, we're going to reward you, and it's going to be double. It's going to be double. Bear that in mind. This is our second address, 15 and 56. Like as thou hast done unto my chosen, said Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, even so shall Yahweh do unto thee, and shall deliver thee into mischief. 
it's going to be a recompense. Oh yeah, I hasten the day. Yeah, how a raptor say, I hope to be a part of the elect number. Because I'm going to jack you up. I'm going to jack you up. This is uh, Isaiah 14 and 1. Prepare slaughter for his children, for the iniquity of their fathers, that they do not rise, nor possess the land, nor fill the face of the world with cities. Because that's what Esau does. Everywhere you go, you build up. You build up a city. You build up uh, uh, kingdoms. That's what you like to do. Like the scriptures say, y'all in my thoughts, is that your houses shall remain forever. Like I said, uh, uh, all the main stuff y'all did to us. Feeding our babies, the gators. The, 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 the sodomizing us. You know, with buck breaking. You know, uh, you got a lot to pay for, Esau Edom. A lot. And it's going to be a recompense. Check this one out. This one is a favorite one of mine. This is Ezekiel 25 and 14. And I will lay my vengeance upon Edom by the hand of my people Israel. And they shall do an Edom according to my anger and according to my fury. And they shall know my vengeance, said Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai. Can you're gonna know the vengeance of Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai? This is Revelation 18 and 6. Reward her even as she rewarded you, and double unto her. Double according to her works in the cup which she had filled, filled to her double. We're gonna get you. We're gonna get you, Esau Edom, and we're gonna jack you up real bad. Like the scriptures say, prepare for slaughter. Uh, close over with this last scripture here. Revelation 13 and 10. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the patience and the faith of the saints. Now somebody might ask, who is the saints? According to Psalms 148 and now 14, the saints are the children of Israel. So here is the faith and the patience of us. That's you Native Americans, Negroes, and Latinos, and confusion of faces who might know that you are Israelites. Esau, Edom, prepare yourself here. Yeah? Recompense is on the way. So with that, I hope you'll be edified. I'd like to give all praise, glory, and honor to the supreme power, Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rekha Kudash. Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and salutation to the hopefully elect in the four winds to win the wake in humility and charity. Risking your lives and freedom to do so. Now, more than ever, to you I salute. Shalom and a bad babal.